Oh man, I'm so sick. <laughs> All right, Junior, here's your soup, and you better blow it because it's very hot. I wanted alphabet soup. Well, we don't have any alphabet soup here, Junior. Just eat what I make. It looks like throw up. It's not throw up. It's good for you, okay? Well, if it's so good, why don't you eat it? <laughs> Junior, you just made a mess all over me. You know what? I'm gonna tell your dad. What the oh, you little bastard, Bowser! You don't raise your voice at me, boy. You use your inside voice. You got me? <sighs> Look, Junior's making a mess and he's sick. He's sneezing on everything. Oh, God, you're his dad, so take care of him. Listen, Pee Pee, I'm a grown ass man. You got that? I don't have to take care of my son if I don't want to. Oh, I could snap your neck like a damn twig if you wasn't so sexy. Oh, God, let me check on the stupid ass boy. Junior, Chef Pee Pee said you're sick. What? Who made this mess? Uh, uh Chef Pee Pee did. Uh, he threw it because he said you don't pay him enough. Well, it looks like he's gonna take a pay cut. Oh, Dad, I'm really, really sick. <laughs> Ew, cooties, gross. Stay away from me. Oh, Dad, I don't have cooties. <laughs> uh, I'm sick. I need you to take care of me. Well, I can't do that, son. I'm sorry. Uh, uh, what are you doing? Uh, I do. Damn it, Julia, what's wrong with you? Uh, Dad, you're not supposed to hit me. Well, you're not supposed to sneeze on me either. Well, Dad, you're supposed to call a doctor. Well, don't you have some Kleenex? Doesn't that help? Well, Dad, I need a doctor to give me medicine. Well, let me go call the doctor then. God. Hey there, somebody call a doctor? I did. He's sick or something. Okay, what's wrong? Well, uh, my whole body hurts, <laughs> and I can't stop coughing or sneezing, and I have a fever. I think I need medicine. No, I can't do that. Well, what, you can't give me medicine? Nope, we can't even show medicine anymore. Because apparently medicine's not family friendly. Because in family friendly land, everybody just eats bubble gum and cotton candy and has a real nice time. And in family friendly land, you never even get sick in the first place. Wait, wait, well, can you give me a flu shot? No, 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 don't, don't even say that. No, we can't do flu shots. And that's been confirmed by manual review, meaning that somebody watched it and said, nope, no more flu shots, that's a big no-no. Because -no. apparently, in family-friendly land, all you get is gumdrop kisses. Oh, well, then, what can you do for me? Um, I can give you a big thumbs up and tell you to stay away from everybody else. Wait, stay away from everybody else? Why? Well, because he's contagious. What does contagious mean? Well, it means he can get you sick if you're too close to him. Dad, why am I outside? Because you're sick, Junior, and you're not going to get me sick. So you're staying outside until you feel better. But, Dad, I don't want to sleep outside. Hey, Junior, you want to buy some grits? Uh, some grits? Yeah, we're uh, selling grits for a fundraiser. Oh, Cody, don't be shy. We're raising money so Mommy can get new implants. I want big gazongas. She's tired of stuffing her bra. Oh, no, I can't really buy grits right now. I'm really, really sick. <laughs> you're sick? Why aren't your mommy and daddy taking care of you? Because I don't have a mommy and my dad doesn't like me. Well, well, I could take care of you. Shut up, mom. Stay in your lane. What, you'll take care of me? Of course, honey. C come on, let's go in the house and take care of you. Oh, really? There, there, sweetie. All tucked in. Now just let mommy Judith take care of you. Okay, great, mommy's all tucked in. Now we can go. We still have a lot of grits to sell. Cody, my breast implants can wait. Your friend here is sick. Oh, well, how are you going to get breast implants from selling grits? It's part of the Grits for Tits program. If you sell a hundred box of grits, they give you a new rack. And I want double D's. Well, shoot. If she's going to be taking care of me, I want something good to look at. I'll take a hundred boxes. No, you won't, Junior. Those tits are mine. Boys, boys, I have two. One for each of you. Well, actually, you're a cow, so you have four. Mom, can, can we just go? No, Cody. Not until we take care of your friend here. What do you need, honey? Um, some alphabet soup would be nice. Okay, alphabet soup coming right up. M Mom, if you like him so much, why don't you just get a room? C Cody, Cody, don't be so mad. Let's just go get some soup for your friend. There you go, honey. There's your alphabet soup, made special just for you. What? I love you. <laughs> M Mom, you wrote I love you in his soup? Oh, how did that get there? I I'm sorry, that must have been a mistake. Wh a mistake, Mom! Those are the only letters in the bowl! And also, you gave me a fork instead of a spoon. Listen, lady, I understand you eat cake all the time, so you always need a fork, but I need a spoon, you fat pig. See, Mom, he doesn't even appreciate it! I is there anything else I can get you, honey? Well, um, 